Okay, we're here with the uh, New Lenox Chamber of Commerce. What's your name? Hi, I'm Emily Johnson. I'm the CEO of the New Lenox Chamber, and I'm here with Patty Cunningham of Crest Lighting, my VP of Membership, and our Chamber President, Gary Fouts of the Grounds Guys. So this is an amazing event. Um, what's, what's the reason we're doing this? Sure. The Expo, um, we hold, it's one of our annual events. Um, it's one of the ways that we bring the community together to celebrate all that there is to um, see, shop, um, utilize here in New Lenox. Um, we have over, I think, 78, 78, Patty knows. We have 78 businesses, organizations, civic groups here today. Um, it's a really good representation of what New Lenox has to offer. Um, was, how, how hard was it to do this? It's a group event. It's a really the whole, um, the board, a solid group of volunteers really come together to, to, to make this happen. Um, it's an annual event. We do it every year. It's fun. So it doesn't feel like much work at all. That's great news. Um, what, what is it the, that you'd like to, to, to tell the community about this event that, um, we can give, you can say. Sure. Um, the, Chamber Expo is a great way to spend your Saturday as a family. You can come out, um, see the various businesses that are here. Um, if you're looking to remodel your home or do landscaping, we've got local businesses that can help you with any project that you have, um, as well as um, various organizations for you to get involved with. Um, there are some a couple churches here. We have um, Cash Creek Animal um, Rescue doing a pet adoption. Really, just kind of... It really is, I would say, like full circle of really of New Lenox, um, and it's a we have a jump. There's a jumpy and Disney princesses and Captain America's here. It's a really just a fun day for your family um, on a cold March morning. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Hi, I'm Leah Mason, and I'm here with NLC TV at. Lincoln Way Central High School at the Community Business Expo and I have Nancy with me and Mayor Tim is gracing us with his presence. How's it going today? It's going very well. I don't know what kind of grace it is but I'm happy to be here. Leah, thank you. And Nancy, how are you doing today? Very well. Very pleased with the turnout here today. So tell us a little bit about your um, venue and what you're kind of doing here today. What's your goal? Well, New Lenox is obviously a great community. Uh, we've got so many wonderful people and businesses that are here, so we're happy to support those local businesses. There's a lot happening in New Lenox. It's constantly in the rankings of safest community. We're the fastest growing community in Will County. We've got quite a bit happening here every day. Yes, and Nancy, what have you been kind of spreading to the people that come up here? Well, there's a lot of questions on when the redevelopment of Route 30 in Cedar is going to happen because people are really excited about CVS and Fleckenstein, Zembar, and Durbin's. And we're working, we have been working with those developers for years. I mean, it's almost going on two years now. Um, we hope to break ground this spring once everything gets into place. But we are really excited to rejuvenate that corner with new development. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for taking some time to speak with us. Okay. My pleasure. I also want to introduce Leah. This is her first interview. So, Leah, <laughs> tell us, how did you get involved with Channel 6? Well, I just walked into the village and I said, um, hi, my name is Leah, and I would love to work for you and get some experience. Oh, wow. Well, just so you know, this is a lot of work. Our volunteers at Channel 6 do a tremendous job for us. I don't know that it's really work, work, because you don't get compensated, other than you get to put that beautiful face on camera, and that will certainly bring viewers to us. So good, congratulations, and thanks for volunteering your time. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hello, I'm Doug, and I'm, and I'm here with Sandy. Hi, how are you, Doug? Good. Can you tell me a little bit about your business, Sandy? Um, the name of our business is Associated Orthodontist. Um, we place braces on patients' teeth. We have a large variety range of patients from children to um, teenage students to adults. And can you tell me about uh, your locations and where you're at and how long you've been around? Um, we've been around since 1969. We have four wonderful doctors and we have five locations in Joliet, Frankfurt, Bourbonnet, Morris, and Plainfield. Great, and how would somebody get a hold of your business? We have a website, www.greatbraces.com. Great, thanks, Sandy. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with Integrated Physical Medicine, and your name is? Dr. Josh Aldrinkamp. Josh, uh, what are you doing here? 
Uh, right here I'm rubbing and working on this young lady's upper traps. Um, she comes in with a lot of upper neck pain and upper back pain, so we find that a lot of these muscles are very tight, so it's important to work on them. And uh, do you have to do this every week or, or monthly? or? For her active care, we do it every week. Um, she spends a lot of time working on a computer, so she gets a lot of headaches and those kinds of things. So working and doing chiropractic medicine and soft tissue for the upper back is very helpful in treating headaches and chronic headaches. Uh, is this um, a common problem for people? As technology increases, we spend more and more time on our phones, more and more time on our f tablets, computers, so we see an increasing number of patients with quote-unquote tech neck. Well, thank you for your time. Good luck here today. Thank you. Hello, I'm Vita from Channel 6. I'm here with Lisa at the Expo. Lisa, tell me a little bit of the company that you're with. Well, I'm with Newmark Credit Union. My name is Lisa Klein. I'm the branch manager here in New Lenox. And uh, we're so excited to be here with you guys today. Excellent. Well, tell us how long have you been in the New Lenox area? Oh, actually, this, this month is our one-year anniversary. So we're so excited to, to come and, and, and put a presence here in, in New Lenox. Uh, of course, we have a lot of membership out here. Uh, we're open to the public. So come on in and see us. Okay. Um, to open an account, do we have to pay a certain minimum balance? No. All you have to do is come on in and open up a savings account, and then you're a member. Excellent. Thank you, Lisa. All right. I am here with Michelle, the 2016 Business of the Year owner of m and Flooring. How are you doing today? I'm doing really good. Doing really well. All right. So tell us a little bit about your business. We've been in business a total of 23 years. We've grown up in New Lenox. Um, we do carpet, wood, laminate, LVT, um, customize anything you need. So where can the citizens of New Lenox contact you and find your um, business? We are located at 336 West Maple in New Lenox on the corner of Route 30 and Vine Street. And our phone number is 815-485-4884. Awesome. Well, I'll see you later. Okay, thank you Have very a good much. day. Hi, I'm Doug, and this is Anna. Anna, could you tell me a little bit about your business? Sure, I'm here from Lamont Nursing and Rehab Center. We're a full-skilled nursing facility, so we focus on short-term rehab. We also do have long-term care, so we're 158 beds currently. We have a 28-bed um, memory care unit upstairs, which is secured. Um, so right now, actually, the new and exciting thing for us is we're building a new rehab unit. So we're connecting the buildings right now. Um, should be done hopefully in May. And what we're doing, we'll have private suites available. We'll have a brand-new therapy gym, which will be great. Um, we have state-of-the-art equipment that'll be put in there. We'll have a media room and a library and whatnot. So it'll really kind of expand our community. Um, but currently we do focus on the short-term rehab population. Oh, that's great. And how would somebody get in contact with your business, Anna? Sure, they're welcome to give me a call anytime. I'm always available. You can check us out online. So our website is www.lamontcenter.com or you can give me a call at 630-243-0400. Great. Thanks, Anna. Sure. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with uh, some uh, board members from our uh, Lincoln Way District 210. Um, introduce yourself. Chris Kozel. Dee Molinari. Joe Kirking. Um, so what, what are you guys doing at the Business Expo? Uh, we are here uh, talking about Lincoln Way and all the great things that Lincoln Way is doing in the community and here is outreach to our community uh, to get to know our constituents better. Thank you, Chris. Very well said. <laughs> We're also handing out these great brown pencils to all the community members who stopped by today. Thank you. Um, I'm short of questions. <laughs> <laughs> um, have you been doing this a long time? The board position? I was appointed in June of 2016. Dee has been since... Go ahead, Dee. How long have you been on the board? I've been on the board since 20, December of 2011, and we've been participating in the expo for many years, as long as I think it's been going on. And I'm a lifelong resident, and I can say I've been at the expo every year for over 11 years uh, as a board member, and been here reaching out to the community. I'm sorry. That's right. <laughs> uh, what do you think about, uh, how do you feel about the, the future of the, the school district? I think the district is is on a 
path to uh, financial recovery and our academics and uh, some of the awards that we've gotten recently, our national recognition and our ranking of the number one safest school in Illinois are just some of the accolades that we, we have received recently. We are on the path um, to a good financial position. Moving forward, we've put in place many initiatives to create transparency throughout the district, and we appreciate all the Lincoln Way families, community, always supporting our school. I'd agree, I think the future is very bright. And what I would like to add is, if everybody's, when you're watching this, come out and see the things that are going on at the school. Well, with spring musicals, spring sports, other things that are going on at the school. So come on out and experience the students at the school. Thank you all very much for your time. Okay, hi, I'm here with Roberto. Tell me, what company are you here with? I'm here with uh, Window World of Joliet. Uh, we are the JD Power Consumer Reports uh, best window vendor for four years straight. Um, we offer um, uh, brand new windows, energy efficient windows, safe, secure windows um, to homeowners throughout the area. Uh, we offer free estimates. Um, more than happy for anyone to actually come for us to come out, invite us to come out to their home so that we can pro provide an assessment of the new windows and how we can help improve their efficiency of their uh, homes as well as enhance the beauty of their homes. Uh, we do sliding, uh, si siding, sorry, um, patio doors, uh, doors as well as windows. Excellent, thank you. What's your name and what's your business? Yeah, I'm Dan Drouss with Window Works, Homeworks, Tiger Bath and Tiger Remodeling. Great. Could you tell us a little bit about your business, Dan? Oh, yeah. Yes, we uh, do all kinds of uh, projects that you might be looking to do in your home. We do siding, gutters, fascias and soffits, roofing. We now do attic insulation. Uh, we do entry doorways, windows, bathrooms, kitchens, basements. And you've probably seen a lot of our commercials on HGTV as well as on your local newspapers. Great, Dan. Now, how would somebody get a hold of your business and where are you located at? Well, we have locations all over the uh, Chicagoland area. We service all the way up basically to the Wisconsin border, as far south as Kankakee, as far west as to uh, Carpen uh, Carpentersville, the Rockford area, and uh, as far east in northwest Indiana. And you can give us a call at 708-633-8600. Again, 708-633-8600. 8600 or visit any of our websites mywindowworks.com, myhomeworks.com, mytigerbath.com, and mytigerroofingroof.com. Thanks, Dan. Okay, I'm here with Embroid Me, and your name is? Uh, Bill Garrigan. Bill, there's a lot of great stuff on this table, and um, wh what, are we, what are we selling here? We are your promotional marketing partner. Anything you want to promote for your business, organizations, non-for-profits, church, schools, we can do it. So like? Personal stuff too. What's your name? Candace. Candace? Yes. So so if I had a like a special birthday party, you could do a t-shirt or? Here's a here's a t-shirt here. We can do uh, printing on t-shirts. We do uh, direct-to-garment printing. We also do screen printing. So um, what other, do you do um, set like big signs? We can do some signage, we do wall, you know, different sizes and things like that. Um, I don't think I have anything on display here, but we do some displays or like, uh, it's not really like a wooden sign or something, it's more like it's, it has an adhesive on the back. So what, what's the uh, most unusual request that you've ever had? Most unusual request? <laughs> Speaking of birthday parties, a gentleman came in a few years ago and uh, he wanted to know if we could uh, embroider a thong. A, a, a thong? He never followed up with it, but he did want to know. I said, well, I guess we could. We'd have to see them and they have to be new. We could embroider anything. Right? Yeah. So, we yeah. could embroider anything. Could it, yeah. <laughs> but he never did follow up. All right. Thank you much, very much for your okay. time. I'm here with Lynn, Joe, and Julie with Vitality Health Systems. Tell us a little bit about your business. Vitality Health is known as a weight loss system, but it does way more than that. It's a health management system that combines both technology and organic foods. We teach people how to eat based on their system, and we test your system through technology. Here today we're doing 
free body analysis, body comp analysis, and it's done through this hocus pocus kind of scale. Scale, that I almost stepped on, <laughs> right down there. Um, but if you come into our office for a consultation and join the program, it gets really advanced. We're able to tell through technology what's going on in your body, what's wrong, what's working, what isn't working, and from that, analyze what foods you need to eat based on you. So everybody's on a little bit of a different diet. We teach you how to shop. It's not prepackaged foods. It's a wonderful program. For me personally, I lost 27 pounds in 40 days. But my bigger goal was I was pronounced dead a few years ago, came home to die in April, last here April. You are. And here I am and I was really suffering. I 22 pills a day with medicine. I'm down to just taking my blood pressure medicine and it's at half the level that it was. Vitality literally turned my life around. I actually work for another company too, but because I'm so passionate about what they did for me, I act as their spouse to give person. back. Oh my God, yeah. I love well, that. you're holding this. What exactly is this barrel of fat? I'm assuming that's what this is. Joe talk so about this. <laughs> each one of these is five pounds of fat. And we have a barrel here showing 50 pounds. I actually lost 50 pounds on my first 40 day program at Vitality. Wow, so this sounds like a promising program. I went in, not real sure, but when I, so I went into my regular doctor, I went for blood work prior to it, and then I went after, and I was blown away by all my results. I had my cholesterol shot down, uh, I was borderline diabetic, not borderline diabetic anymore. That was all off my first round. Wow. And then I wanted to lose more, because I was, um, and I'm down about 105 pounds total. I've done it two uh, two rounds and lost another 50 pounds after the second round, and now I'm on my third round. Wow, congratulations. So where can we find your business and how can we contact you? We're in New Lenox. Uh, our address is 352 West Maple. We're in the strip mall with um, what is that, Ace Harbor. And uh, you contact us. Uh, of course, I don't remember our phone number. I don't but either. Uh, <laughs> That's all right. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us today, and good luck today. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, hi, I'm here with Becca and Beck. Phil. I'm so sorry. Okay, Becca, tell us a little bit of the booth that you're here with. Well, we are a family-owned company. We do all your flooring needs. We do carpet, hardwood, tile, epoxy. We do carpet cleaning as well. Okay, and the company is? Fabian's Flooring. We've been around for 33 years uh, in New Lenox the whole time. Excellent. Anything else you want us to know? That, that's it. We Great service, great products, and hope to hear from somebody. Excellent. Anything, Becca, you want to end with? I don't know. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with Hourglass Wealth Management. What's your name? Ed Consul. Ed, what does Hourglass do? So we, uh, we're we in uh, investments, um, so we offer investment solutions as far as uh, 529 college planning, uh, state and tax planning, um, uh, you know, just individual and uh, business wealth planning, um, you know, things like that. Do you uh, offer, uh, do you do like stock trades and stuff too? Uh, we do, we do. We do offer uh, individual um, like brokerage accounts uh, that clients can come in um, and, you know, participate in the market. Um, what, what's your, your best stock tip? <laughs> um, invest in the market now. The market's doing really well right now, so get in now while you can. Take advantage of it. Is there any particular company that you, you feel very strongly about? Uh, I, I can't I can't say right now that that any any single company, but I would say get in the market now while the market's hot. Okay, so let me ask you this: I have some AT and T stock. Should I hold on to it or should I sell it? Uh, no comment. <laughs> All right, thank you very much for your time, Ed. Right, thanks a lot. Okay, so I am here with Patty from Perennial Crest Lighting and Kyle from Legrand. Um, Take a little time to introduce yourself and what you're doing here today. Sure. I'm Patty from Paramount EO Crest Lighting, and we're here at the expo to showcase our uh, product, Legrand, and Kyle's here to give you some more details on the product. Kyle, what do we have here? So some really exciting redesigned product for us. Um, Legrand's been a, an electrical manufacturer, manufacturing Pass and Seymour 
uh, electrical devices, switches, outlets, dimmers, wall plates for about 100 years. This is our Adorn collection. And what we've done is redesigned just commodity products. So giving people more options, different styles of switches and dimmers. We've got about 50 different wall plate finishes that you can pair with any of these devices. Easy one for one replacement. So anyone can go into their home and swap out what they have today and put something in that looks much better on the wall. So. Awesome. So where can citizens of New Lenox find your business? You would want to go to Paramount EO and Crest Lighting. Um, and we're in, on Gauger and Farrell. Okay. And Okay, awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us today. Thank you. Hi, I'm here with one of the co-owners of, you tell me the company again? Paul and Mike's Transmissions. Oh, yeah, I remember I used to get parts here from you um, years ago. Well, we used to sell parts and service all types of automobiles. Now we just are, have our service department open. So we don't sell just parts anymore. So, yet yeah, we've been around since 1955. We don't do just transmissions. We are a complete auto care facility. Excellent. And you're saying, how many years have you been in business? Uh, 61 years. Last November, we celebrate our 61 year anniversary and we are family owned and operated. Excellent. Thank you. Okay, what's your name and what are you doing here with the booth? Hi, I'm Officer Mike Yurka with the New Lenox Police Department and we're here today at the Business Expo just to get some information out to the public about being safe and some upcoming events we have going on. We have on April 26th our severe weather spotter training class over at Lincoln Way West and there's a health expo before that. That's going to be from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. is the expo and then 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. is going to be the weather spotter class. So that's something that's really important we're looking forward to. Just got some, you know, giveaways to give out, you know, erasers that change colors, which is pretty cool to work off of, you know, the heat so the kids in class, instead of paying attention to their teachers, which they should be doing. So if you're watching out there, kids, listen to your teachers, don't be messing around with this. But the erasers will change colors, it works off the heat in their hands. You know, other information, got Will County, you know, text to 911. Recently, the, our dispatch center was able to get the, uh, computer programs to start where you can send text messages. It's call if you can, text if you can't, so they have a lot of information on there, so you want to go to their website. And obviously, you know, everyone's concerned with the drug problem across the country, so we have some flyers, you know, for the truth about drugs, so parents and kids can really get a good, good idea of what they're dealing with when it comes to that. And then we have, you know, our New Lenox Police Cadets are always looking to get new cadets, so anyone between the ages of 14 and 21, you know, could uh, come down to our police station, file, uh, fill out a, re um, I was going to say a report, so used to saying that stuff. <laughs> fill out an application, and our cadets meet twice a month on Mondays from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m., and they go over all sorts of different police training, and it gives them a great chance to find out if they're interested in becoming a police officer. So for those that are like, oh, I want to be an officer when I get older, they could see what it's really like before they commit to a college and be like, get there and be like, you know what, I don't think this is what I thought it was. So our cadets do a great job with coming out, and they help out with a lot of different events, and especially with the uh, concerts, the triple play concerts, they're out there helping out, being at the gates, making sure people are being safe. So we just want to get all this information out there you know, for everyone to, uh, you know, remember to be safe. Great, Officer Mike. That's very helpful. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm here with Judy Sweeze from Cedar Way Vet Clinic in New Lenox on Laraway. Uh, it's very nice to meet you. Um, tell us a little bit about your clinic. Well, we've been on Laraway Road for almost 10 years. We're going to have an open house in July to celebrate our 10-year anniversary. Um, we have two doctors, Dr. Tineo, and the owner is Dr. Frank Hogawig. Um, Dr. Tineo sees exotic pets as well as dogs and cats. Dr. Frank does see the dogs and cats. He also does orthopedic surgeries. Um, he is the winner of the Southwest uh, Choice Awards Best Veterinarian, so we're very, very excited and honored about that. And we have a great staff of about 10 or 11 people, and we hope that you'll come and see us. We think we're the best veterinarian around in clinic. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, what's the uh, most unusual pet you've had? Most unusual dog breed or cat breed? Uh, cat breed would probably be the hairless cat, which is, don't see too many of, they're kind of rare. Dogs, we see all sorts of dogs, mixed breeds. We see a lot of uh, rescue pets. Um, probably the most unusual might be, oh, a cross between a Chihuahua and a Japanese Chin. 
She's very cute, but she's very unusual looking. Her name's Trixie. Is that one of those dogs with all the funky teeth and they're all hairless looking? Uh, they're kind of scruffy looking, but they're adorable. And we love them all. But we do see uh, snakes, we see rats, we see guinea pigs, we see bunnies. Um, we see just about anything. That's great. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah, well, I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you very much. Come see us. I'm here with Jimmy from Chicagoland Internet Auto. Tell us a little bit about what your company is and what you do. Well, we've been in uh, New Lenox for nine and a half years now. Uh, we sell used cars under $10,000, so yeah. Uh -huh. Very nice. So where can we find your business? 410 North Vine Street, right across from the KFC on Route 30. Awesome. Any special deals going on? We always have deals going on. Uh, come on in, see me, see my dad, Pete, and uh, we'll give you the best price possible. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank you for speaking with us today. Thank have you. a good Absolutely. one. Hello, I'm here with Martin yes. and Debbie. Tell me a little bit of why, what you're here for for the New Lenox Six. Well, for New Lenox Township, every year we have a, what we refer to as our annual cleanup day. We're moving our, our theory just a little bit towards recycling and reusing versus just simply throwing in the trash. So what we found over the years is that many of the items that we used to pick up on a curbside collection on our cleanup day were really items that could have been donated, reused, recycled, and we ended up throwing a lot of those into a landfill, and they were very expensive to do that. So the cost for the curbside collection has basically tripled in, th in, in a five-year period. So the decision was made to move away from the curbside collection and move towards recycling. So if you have furniture that you've replaced and you have some usable furniture and you just don't really know what to do with it, there are places that will try to get that furniture reused. Uh, Goodwill, uh, our mission here in New Lenox, several other places in Joliet. Some will even come and pick up the furniture and make sure it goes to someone that can use it. So our, our theory is to try to get as many of these items reused or recycled versus throwing them in a landfill. But we also collect on May 6th at our township site uh, batteries, tires, uh, we do latex paint recycling, uh, we have traditional recyclables, your glass, plastic, paper, cardboard that we'll take there as well. So that all happens on May 6th. Okay, and Debbie, I see you're here and tell us the, the reason you're here. I'm here, I'm the manager of the transportation department. Uh, we run a transportation service that runs Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. And it's for everybody, not just for seniors. Anybody that needs a ride can call us up. It's based upon reservations, so call anytime you need a ride. Okay, well, give us the number. The number is 815-485-6431, and then you can ask for transportation or just ask for Debbie. Okay, thank you. Hi, can you tell me your name and what your business is? My name is Karen Rizak and I am the Marketing and Parent Outreach and Fundraising Coordinator at Lincoln Way Special Recreation. We are part of the Park Districts, um, but we only do programming for special needs. So we have all of the Lincoln Way areas, uh, and recently we just wrapped up our basketball season. We have six Special Olympic basketball teams, we have four wheelchair basketball teams. So we run both Special Olympic programs as well as Paralympic programs. And we also do things like social programs, we have Zumba, we have a cooking class, we have an awesome drama group that performs uh, little plays. So if you haven't seen us, come check us out. We're down on Laraway Road in the Heather Glen subdivision, we're that great big building in the middle of all the houses. But our participants are in everybody's subdivision. So uh, we do have a couple events coming up. I have a Bunny Breakfast, which is coming up on April 15th. It is over at Lincoln Way East. It's an awesome event. We have an Easter egg hunt. You have lunch. We have breakfast with the bunny. You have. Uh, they can do a craft. There's face painters. They get a picture with the bunny, and it's all a fundraiser for LWSRA. Great, Karen. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Okay, I'm here with Ron Sly, a uh, candidate for New Lenox Township Highway Commissioner. Right. Ron, tell us why you're running. Uh, I had, uh, I've worked for the village for 35 years, ran the public works department, and uh, retired from there. Now I've been in the construction industry as an estimator for the past three years. I like to bring that skill to the job, all that experience, and put it to work for the Township Highway Department. 
Are there things that, that the Township Highway does that you'd like to see changed? Um, it, there's always room for improvement. You know, that I'm not fully aware of every issue they've got. You know, I've, I've worked with them on a, for 35 years on different projects and such. Um, so I, some of the things I see is I'd like to increase some of the signage out there uh, for road name signs. I, I think there's improvement there and improvement in um, the communications with the uh, public. That's, uh, you know, this is 2017. It, it, you should be able to get there with the, the easy access by uh, your computer and through a website, Facebook, whatever, and get your complaints addressed. So that's my plan. <laughs> I see. That's that's pretty good thinking. Um, are, what are the, the the strengths that you see in in the the New Lenox Highway Department? Um, they, all the roads are in pretty good shape now. They've had a pretty robust program for the last with the current uh, Highway Commissioner. They've paved all the roads in New Lenox, um, so that's a big plus. You know, there's a lot of uh, towns that, or townships that don't have that luxury to have all the roads done. So, and uh, they have a real good snow removal program. Now, I've done that for 35 years for the, on the village side. I know how to do it and uh, could continue with that and make some improvements wherever we can. All right, thanks a lot for your time. I'm here with my friend Heidi and she is selling Nerium. What exactly is Nerium? Oh my gosh, Nerium is so amazing. It's an entire uh, line of products for your face, for your body, and for your mind. It gets rid of fine lines and wrinkles, puffiness, dark circles, firms and tones of the body. Um, great for uh, brain enhancement, which is amazing. Um, one of my favorites is the Nerium Eye Serum that gives you immediate results and long-lasting results the longer that you use it. Um, there's a the night cream, the day cream for the face, the body contouring cream for the entire body, firm and tone, especially if you're getting ready for summer girls, you got to firm and tone your body up, especially that mommy, mommy belly. Um, I use all the products. I love them. Very happy with my results. Um, if you guys are interested, come on down to the home show. We're here from 9 to 1. Or check out my website, which is hrigsby.nerium.com. That's h-r-i-g-s-b-y.nerium.com. Awesome. Well, thank you. And you're a beautiful spokesperson, obviously. So um, thank, you. thank you. Hi. What's your name and what's your business today? Hi, I'm Diana Kroll with the New Lenox Community Park District. And um, we're here today to talk about all of our summer programs that we have coming out. We also have our summer catalog that'll be coming out in April. So look for that with all of our summer camps, all of our athletic programs that are coming out. We're also here today to talk about our banquet facility that we have. Um, it, it, we have room rentals, banquets, we have a full bar available. So if you would like more information on any of this, you can call the New Lenox Park District at 815-485-3584 or go to website at www.newlenoxparks.org. Great, thanks Diana, very helpful. Okay, I'm here with the New Lenox Dental Group and your name is? Nikki. Nikki, um, you got a pair of teeth there and a toothbrush. Um, can, you, can you give us a little demonstration for our younger viewers? I sure can. So patient education is very important. We come from at our office. So we bring this as our model to show younger viewers how to use the um, brush their teeth. You want to go in a circular motion, always using a soft toothbrush, and make sure you do all three sides of each arch. So you've got this side here, which is your cheek, your tongue side, and then your biting surface. So go all around the mouth, on the top, and on the inside. And make sure you do it for at least two minutes, and that's how you can have a healthy smile. Thanks. Um, New Lenox Dental Group, where is that located? We're at 1600 West Lincoln Highway, so we're located right where the old Kmart used to be, right next door to Williamson's, where that standalone building. Uh, thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. You have a great day. Thanks. I am here with Jeff and Brian with Rigsby Builders. Tell us a little bit about what this picture situation is back here. Okay, so what this is is one of our communities. This is a single family subdivision in New Lenox off of Marley Road, um, uh, pretty close to Sanctuary Golf Course. And we've got 11 lots left in the subdivision. It's a beautiful community. Um, we've been there since 2007 and uh, looking to build out. So we're encouraging people to just drive by, drive through, take a look at the available lots. We would love to talk to you about building a home there. We also we do new construction. We also do remodeling and addition work all around the area, the new Lincoln, or, uh, Lincoln Way community. Uh, and then we also do commercial work. So if you have a business and you're looking for an office build out, uh, we would be happy to talk to you. Awesome. How can we contact you? In, probably the easiest way is to jump on our website. It's rigsbybuilders.com. 
Um, and uh, there you'll find all of our contact information. Our offices are located over on Old Plank Drive off of Schoolhouse Road. We're a local community. We've been in the area for 27 years um, and would love to talk to you about any of your building needs. One of our other companies is in durable coverings. So if you have a need for any type of protective coating on your flooring, like garage floors, shop floors, office floors, and we go vertical, we do walls too. So we do the complete assemblage for wall protection and floor protection. So. Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us. Good nice luck. To meet you, Leah. Nice to meet you too. Hello. I'm here with Patricia Evans of Mary Kay Cosmetics, and she's going to tell us a little bit about the booth she's at. Yes, we're here today at the Chamber of Commerce Expo and delighted to be here to represent our wonderful company. Mary Kay has been around since 1953 and it's got many, many products for men as well as women, um, body care, skin care, which is the main thrust of our product line. There's also some new featured items that come out during the seasonal times like spring and the fall, which introduce some new colors that will be for the season, kind of working in with the fashions. And today we are actually working and looking for new faces for our cause, the Mary Kay Charitable Foundation, which is for cancer research and domestic violence. So we are just thrilled to be here and be a part of the community. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, what's your name and what you got your booth today? My name is Sadie Dominguez and we're with Party Hoppers today. We're here um, doing just a little bit of advertising. Great, and so can anyone come and join the ho hopper or how does this work? Oh yes, it's free to everybody that comes in today. They come in, they jump for about three minutes, everybody out, and then the next group goes in. Great, and how would someone get a hold of your, your business? Um, they can call us directly, 815-603-4377, or they can go on our website, partyhoppersfun.com. Great, thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with the new at the booth for the New Lenox Public Library, one of my favorite places in town. Awesome. Um, what's your name? I'm Amy. I'm I'm the head of adult services at New Lenox Library, and I'm Liz, and I do the marketing and graphic design at the library. Um, so, what's your favorite book? Uh, I love Harry Potter. So that actually ties into our theme for our big fundraiser that's coming up in April. So our friends of the library put it on, and it's one of our biggest fundraisers to help us. Um, do more programming and buy different things for the library. That's fantastic. What's your favorite books? Well, I know everybody will think I'm weird, but I like virus books. So Cobra Event and Hot Zone, <laughs> all the weird books. I don't know why. I just really fascinated by them. So those are my favorite. That's wonderful. Thank you very much for sharing, and uh, good luck with your fundraiser. And uh, like I said, the library is a great place. It's a great program. Awesome. We're very happy to have you guys here. We have a lot of good programs coming up, coming up, and we have a great summer reading coming up, so make sure you come to the library and check it out. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Leah, and I'm here with Hubert the Lion and George from BMO Harris Banking. How are you doing today? Good, Leah. Thanks. Good. So what's kind of going on with BMO Harris? So sure. Um, the nice thing about BMO Harris is we're all about the customer experience. So um, for private banking, commercial banking, residential mortgage, um, personal banking, anything along those lines, we're here to serve you for that whole spectrum of needs for you. So if you'd like to come and stop by us, we're right at 110 West Maple, or we also have our motor bank um, on Lincoln Highway also. So please stop by and come visit us. Awesome, thank you for speaking with us thank today. You. Nice to meet you. Hello, and I'm gonna, you're gonna introduce who you are sure. so I can say it correctly. Hi, my name is Dr. Dolly. I'm a pediatric dentist at Silver Cross Hospital. And uh, we've been there for about four years. We work on children from birth till they go to college. We see them every six months for checkup and cleaning. We also do uh, cavities filling. We do also orthodontics for them. And we also do some work at the uh, Silver Cross OR room for children who cannot do their uh, dental treatment in the office. Uh, we love seeing children, we are part of the community, and we enjoy uh, doing business uh, in New Lenox. Excellent, thank you. Thank you. Hi, can you tell me your name and what yeah, you have at your booth today? Yeah, I'm Father Andrew Harrison, um, and this booth uh, represents uh, an outreach of uh, St. Luke Orthodox Chapel. Um, that the, the main, the, our main parish is in Palos Hills, but we're reaching out into New Lenox area for Orthodox people who live and people interested in, in the Orthodox faith. So we're, that's why we're here today. Great, and can you tell me about some of the services or activities you have going on? 
Uh, well, uh, as any church, we have church, we have uh, liturgy on Sunday morning, which is a traditional Eastern Orthodox liturgy. Um, actually, this is we're moving into our second year uh, in the Lenox area, and uh, we've grown from last year from just two people. Now we have about uh, we've had 80 people go through our church, and we ha we have a regular attendance in the 20s. That's fantastic. Thank you, Father. So, uh, it's, Is there anything welcome. else you would anything else you'd like to tell well, the public we, today? We would invite the community to come and see. We Great. Would, if they'd like to to come and see what an Eastern Orthodox liturgy is like, we are we're on the corner of 112th and Church or 100. No, the, our address is 112 Church Street in New Lenox, and our liturgy is at 10 a.m. Great. Thank you, Father. You're welcome. Okay, my um, I'm here with uh, the New Lenox uh, Cub Scouts, and your name is. Joel Stamborski. I'm the Cub Master for Pac-6. Great. So you know all about this program. What uh, What are your big initiatives for this year? What are What are your big programs? Well, the program that we have for Scouts has uh, changed last year or two, and uh, so we really bring in kids from kindergarten through fifth grade, and they go through a program where it teaches them anything from camping skills to basic home skills and uh, getting out and doing things, be active, but also being able to. Uh, um, know what to do in certain situations. What are some of the more unusual situations that you've encountered with your, your Cubs scouts? Um, I don't know if they call it unusual, but we have, uh, we went to family camp last year and they got to do a climbing wall and uh, that was a lot of fun. They really enjoyed that. They, they went back to about three or four times for that climbing wall. That sounds like a lot of fun. I see here you have a picture with a, with a fire truck and, and some other camping pictures. Um, do you have a, a, a lot of uh, events where the, the kids go out someplace to, to see something, not just camping, but other? We do. We, um, we have other activities. We go to the fire station sometimes. We go to, uh, um, this year we're going to the Adler Planetarium for an overnight. And, uh, but we have other activities that we do during the day, uh, depending on what the requirements are for their level. That's great. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm here with Matt and Rachel with Reclaim, Reclaim Fitness in New Lenox, and anyone that I talk to seems to be going to Reclaim. What makes Reclaim such a hot commodity these days? Well, in my opinion, um, I think that the number one catch about Reclaim is probably the most affordable gym in the area, hands down. I mean, we have rates as low as $10 a month, $10 down as of right now. Um, I mean, that would be the, the number one reason. Uh, number two, I mean, with the, the square footage we have, I mean, there's a lot of space for people to be able to work out, you know, get their cardio in. We got strength training classes, you know, cardio classes, hit training, which is high intensity interval training classes. Not too many you know, gyms are doing that, especially in this area. So that's what makes us exclusive for now. Awesome. So what do you have any special promos going on right now that uh, people can for, get a hold of? The month of, of March right now, we have $10 down, $10 a month, uh, as low as $10 a month. Uh, we have family plans, we have kids care. Hours of operation are 5 a.m. to 11, Monday through Friday, uh, and Saturday and Sunday are 7 to 7. I mean, kids clubs from you know 8.30 a.m. to 1, 4 to 8, Monday through Friday. So, I mean, our current promotion, like I said, is pretty much a discounted enrollment. It's, it's $39 off. So, I, if I could save someone 40 bucks, I would. Awesome, so where can we find you in New Lenox? Uh, it's, from where we're at right now, it's a block and a half, so it's 1325, you know, Lincoln Highway. Uh, I mean, it's right next to the car wash, Lincoln Way, in case people are wondering where the heck that is. Um, I mean, it's a beautiful building, so it's, it's hard to miss. Yes, I've seen it. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us today. Have a great day. Thanks, guys. Hi, I'm here with Jan and Angela, and Jan's going to tell us a little bit about the company she's with. We are Kids Work Children's Museum. We are located inside the trolley barn in downtown Frankfurt. We are the first and only um, children's museum in Will County. Uh, we are operated um, six days a week currently. In summer, we will also be open on Mondays. We host birthday parties. We have all kinds of special programs going on each day and special programs such as Wild Wednesday once a month. We have our upcoming bunny brunch at the Dancing Marlin on April 1st. We are now offering STEM classes, which are engineering programs. Those are on Friday nights and um, 
coming up on May 5th, we have our Cinco de Mayo event. That's our annual fundraiser. And we are operated, truly, we are nonprofit, so we're operated by um, just daily admissions and membership. So we really hope the community will come out to help support us in our fundraiser, either by donations or attending. Okay, and the museum. How many years has the museum been open, did you say? This is our eighth year. And we've been, it was just the brainchild of a couple of moms back eight years ago. And we hope to really grow and expand, you know, as we continue forward. We're hoping to get some new exhibits and just do some freshening up of the museum. So again, why we need the support of the community. Excellent. Give us the address again. It is 11 South White Street in Frankfurt. And again, that's inside the trolley barn. Okay, thank you. Hi, could you tell me your name and what you have at your booth today? Sure, uh, my name is Myrna Campos and I'm with College Illinois. Uh, we are informing um, people here um, that are attending this expo about how to save for college. Um, we are a 529 prepaid tuition program, allows parents to start saving and thinking about you know, saving for their child's future college education when they're young. Uh, so if people want to stop by and learn about the program, we are giving out information. We have a raffle and some coloring books for kids. Great, Myrna. And can you tell me how uh, people can get a hold of you? Yes, we, they can go to our website. It's www.collegeillinois.com. Great, thanks, Myrna. You're welcome. OK, I'm here at the uh, Caldwell Banker booth. Uh, and your name is? My name's Ken Pitleski. I'm the managing broker for the Caldwell Banker office right here in New Lenox. And uh, what, are you, what, are you, what are we doing here? Well, today we're just trying to get uh, our name out in front of the community. We try to stay involved with the community as much as we can, and we're excited to be here at the expo today. So we're mainly just letting people know about what it takes to buy or sell real estate in the community, also offering a career in real estate. Those are three areas that we concentrate in the community. So we're just here today introducing ourselves to uh, hopefully the big crowd we're going to have today. How do you feel about uh, property values here in New Lenox? Property values are certainly going up. We're fortunate to be in a community like New Lenox in Will County. Uh, our New Lenox government here certainly does a lot to keep property values up for us best they can, not just from the real estate end, but from the whole commercial sector. They're always keeping things on the up, so people are wanting to move to this community. Uh, we don't get a lot of people moving out of the area. Usually if they put their homes up for sale, they're still staying in the community buying another home here. So we're pretty fortunate to be in a, in a community that offers that for us. All right, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. I'm Leah and I am here with Pat, Wendy and Kylie with the Lincoln Way West um, Music Car Booster Raffle. Tell me a little bit about what's happening. Uh, we, we are with the Lincoln Way West Music Boosters and this is the third year we've been raffling off uh, a car. This year we're doing a 2017 Jeep Patriot and then uh, the funds benefit all the different programs at Lincoln Way West musically. Uh, you have the marching band, magicals, all the different choirs, you have the spring musical. Uh, so it, it, it does quite a bit of good for the, for the program. Awesome. So how much are the raffle tickets? They are $20 a piece. We are only selling 2,500 tickets. So your odds of winning are pretty good. Wow. Sounds like something I want to enter into. Well, thank you very much for speaking with us today and have a great day. Thank you very much. Hello, I'm here with Luke and Kyle of Boy Scouts. And you know what? I made a mistake and called you a Cub Scout. So tell me the difference between the Cub Scouts and the Boy Scouts. Well, the Boy Scouts do more like campouts or they do more things that would be a little more dangerous. Like in Boy Scouts, we could shoot like guns because I almost got the shotgunning merit badge. In Cub Scouts, you wouldn't be able to do that. Did you want us to tell us anything pertaining to your troop that you're in? Yes. And give us the troop number. Okay, so our troop number is 755, and we're based out of the New Life Church in New Lenox. And right now we're doing a fundraiser for our upcoming chili dinner that funds for all the campouts and different activities that we do around here. And it is on Saturday, April 22nd, and we would love to come. Tickets for adults are $10, and for tickets for children are only $5. We'd love for people to come out. Okay, is there anything else you want us to know? Uh, well, you in Boy Scouts you don't really do Pinewood Derbies 
or anything that would just be like building like stuff out of wood you'd really just you really just try and get merit badges rank up and if you get an eagle you get it's a really big honor excellent thank you hi can you tell me your name and uh, something about your business my name is mike and i'm from noga's landscape we're a full service landscape design company based on new lennox and can you tell me what areas uh, you service uh, we service uh, we're a full service maintenance company that services townhomes uh, townhomes, commercial buildings, industrial buildings. Uh, we do Silver Cross Hospital, we maintain that. Um, we also do brick paver patios, landscape design. We have a full landscape construction division. So we're all around landscaper. Great, Mike, and can you tell me how the public can get a hold of you? Uh, our telephone number is 815-462-4475. Thanks, Mike. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with Gynecologic Surgery and Menopause Solutions. Um, your name is? My name is Susana and we are a um, medical practice located at Silver Cross Hospital. The gynecologist is Dr. Francisco Garcini. He has been in practice for 20 plus years, and here we are offering all the services for women. That's great. Women's services have been a big topic this year. Um, what does is, what is your uh, company do to try and promote that? The main, the main focus for us is to treat women, uh, especially in the menopausal ages. And of course, we treat all the variety of um, symptoms and situations women might have, like prolapse, um, uterine situations, um, uh, fibroids. And Dr. Cursini is a surgeon, so he offers options for women, especially um, robotic surgery or uh, minimal invasive surgery as we call and he also offers um, options for women that have specific intimate um, issues what we call the intimate wellness approach so please visit us we are located at um, Silver Cross Hospital uh, and we'll be more than happy to help you Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. All right. So I'm here with Bill and a familiar face, Lynn, who's hopped back over to her other passion, Trader Magazine. Tell us a little bit about what this is. Uh, the Trader Magazine is a coupon publication. It's distributed, it's mailed out uh, every six weeks. We have eight publications total that go to 237,000 homes in the southwest suburbs. Uh, the local one, the Lincoln Way edition, goes to New Lenox, Frankfurt, Mokina, Elwood, and Manhattan. Awesome, so how can one order one of these magazines? You get it's free, it's free in the mail. It goes to 32,000 homes in those five communities. The Lincoln Way book does. We also have one out in the Joliet area, Plainfield, Orland, Tinley, eight total. Awesome, well thank you so much for doing, oh. Northwest Indiana, our brand yeah, new oh, home. Expanding. Yeah, we're really excited about that, so. And we are truly a community book. We get very involved with the Chambers of Commerce, a lot of the different charity and community events. You'll notice, if you ever look at our book, we're the ones with the photo of somebody from the community. It's usually somebody's kids nice, or nice. just people that submit them. And you can submit your photos for free. Um, I mean, you do not even have to be a client. And we just pick them based on... Awesome. How do you do that? Yeah. You send them to uh, Trader... What is it? TraderValues.com. Right. Okay, well, thank you so much for speaking with us. That's awesome. Hello, I'm here with Mike, and the company is? Eternally Green Lawn Care. Okay, and can you really get the lawns to look as good as these pictures are looking? Can you do that? Like Wrigley Field, yes, like Wrigley Field. We're, we're the sod father. Um, we can, but not all lawns. Some lawns are only going to have certain expectations. We don't, we don't fib to our customers. We let you know how it is. We come out to the house first and do a free estimate, mm -hmm. measure the lawn, assess the lawn, and then give you reasonable expectations as to what we can do. And in most cases, we can exceed your expectations. Getting the lawn off and looking like that, virtually weed-free, green and healthy. And uh, that's how good we are. We've been in business 17 years. Eternally Green's our name. We're in Frankfurt and we service about 170 cities. We have a branch in Lombard and in Frankfurt. We're good. Good is an understatement, but I'll understate it. Excellent, thank well, you. Hi, can you tell me your name and your business today? How you doing? My name is Ivan Johnson and I'm here with Bath Planet today. We are an acrylic bath company. We've been in business for over 20 years now. 
We are doing the wet area of your bathroom. We can do the tub shower conversion, walk-in shower conversion, all in less under a day. So the motto is we come in at eight and leave by five. The, uh, the beautiful acrylic uh, product that we offer is approved by Good Housekeeping Seal. We are the only acrylic bath company that offers that, which allows us to give the homeowner a two-year money-back guaranteed if the product is defective or installed incorrectly. Plus, we offer a lifetime warranty on everything that we do within your wet area. And also, our main plant, the corporate headquarters, is in Libertyville, Illinois. Our showroom here in Illinois is in Streamwood, but we are a franchise and we have 149 locations throughout the United States. So we're in California, Florida, Missouri, you name it. The list goes on. That's fantastic, Ivan. And how can the public get a hold of you? The public can get a hold of us for the most part by doing face-to-face -face interaction, coming to ev events like this, like this, home shows, county fairs. We have mall locations as well, Yorktown Mall, Cherryville Mall, just to name a few, and Spring Hill Mall. So pretty much, if you come, you can see us at county fairs, home shows, and malls, and basically face-to-face. -face. Great. Thanks, Ivan. All right. Thank you, sir. Okay, I'm here with uh, RCM Heating and Cooling, and your name is? My name is Bill Ward. Bill, um, what are we doing here today? We're trying to sell heating and air conditioning equipment, but more importantly, we're trying to expose ourselves to the community. We've been here for 11 years, and we are handing out brochures, we've got a raffle, we've got pens, we've got all sorts of little goodies for our customers, and if anyone has any questions, they can ask us about their heating, air conditioning, indoor comfort, you name it. Anything that has to do with your furnace, your air conditioner, uh, dry air in your house in the wintertime, humidity in the summer, air filtration, you name it. So are you prim pr primarily a residential company? Yes. or Yes, we're primarily residential. And so what's the, uh, what's the most unusual thing you've seen happen in a, in a residential environment? In terms of? Well, uh, something maybe going wonky. Oh gosh, there's so many stories. I don't, I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> okay. I don't, I don't, I don't want to uh, talk about, you know, what we see in certain conditions, but, um, well, most recently, a, I don't know what kind of a critter it was, but he got, they, a, a lot of times they get inside of the air conditioner and the, the electricity, when they get zapped, electricity jumps right through them and just does things like that. Um, <laughs> I, 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 if you start, you can jog my memory, but we've seen a lot. What about uh, uh, what about uh, uh, like birds in the in the in the uh, exhaust? That's not. We don't encounter that too much anymore. Okay. If you don't have a chimney cap, they could sit on there. They become dizzy and they fall down, and they can get pulled all the way into the furnace. I've seen that. I've actually once I pulled a live bird out. I got there in time. <laughs> and I pulled a live bird all the way out of the inducer where the wheel was going around like this. It's like one of the worst movies you've ever seen where somebody's about to get, you know, pulled into a giant grinding machine or something. <laughs> so I actually managed to, but usually you'll find a pile of bones down there. So we were lucky. Well, thank you very much for your time. Is that it? I, I'm not even getting warmed up yet. <laughs> well, thank you very much. It's great talking to you guys. Thank you. Uh -huh. I'm here with Kayla from Odyssey Fun World. Tell us a little bit about this place. Um, Odyssey Fun World is located in Tinley Park, and then we do have a campus in Naperville. And it's just really fun to bring your kids. We want to have birthday parties. There's um, EA, there's rides like Himalaya Roller Coaster, Ferris Wheel. And then in the summer, we do have um, like mini golf. We have go-karts, with batting cages. It's just really fun for the whole family. Ooh, sounds fun. So where can we find your location? Um, we have Tinley Park and Naperville. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us today. Hello, I'm here with Gary and you're with the Share Fest. Tell us a little about it. Well, Share Fest is just uh, a whole bunch of people getting together and uh, going out and loving our neighbors and in some way, shape or form. Just show a little love, a little bit of hope bring a little bit of laughter and fun and uh, and sometimes uh, giving some goods and services that people really need. So this year we have a new concept. You know, every year we used to have a big main event in uh, Spencer School. This year we've had so many requests from so many other communities to go out and help them that we've decided to make our events mobile. 
So we gather food and clothes and books and free health care screenings and different, uh, some of our employers, and we're going to go. We're going to Joliet in uh, July. We're going up in Fairmont in, uh, in July. June is Joliet. July is Fairmont. Uh, August is Romeoville. And our first event, mobile event, is in partnership with Providence Catholic High School. Students and staff are coming out. We're bringing in truckloads of food and books and clothes. And at the, the soccer field parking lot at Route 30 and Gauger Road, April 8th, starting at 11 o'clock to 1 o'clock, we're going to give everything away. So we're very fortunate to have uh, Providence Catholic partner with us in that way this year. So that's a, that's a new event for us, to take ShareFest out into areas that they weren't able to come here, but they heard about what's going on in New Lenox and all the sharing and carrying, and they came to us and pleaded with us to go to them. Okay, and is it open to everyone? We don't turn anybody away, you know? Excellent. Love has no boundaries, right? Excellent. Excellent. Thank you, Gary. You bet. Hi, what's your name and what's your business here today? Uh, I'm Andrew Manalotis from Carefree Lawn Sprinklers. Yeah, and can you tell me a little bit about your services? Sure. So we do uh, lawn irrigation systems, fertilizer, mosquito backpack sprays, mist away systems for mosquito barriers. So we got, we got a lot of different services now at Carefree. Great, and how can the public get a hold of you, Andrew? You can give us a call at 815-462-3300, or you can like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, or go to carefreesystems.com. Great. Thanks, Andrew. Thank you. I'm here with Linda from Window and Siding Planet, and tell us a little bit about your business. Okay, we replace windows, siding, and gutters. Um, actually, we have, some, uh, we have a real big spring sale going on right now. So, if anybody is interested, please call us at 708-478-4434. Awesome, and where can we find you? We are on 18700 Wolf Road in Mokina. Awesome, thank you very much. Oh, Have welcome. a great day. Bye-bye. Oh, hey, Shannon, I see that you're with Wolf's um, Seal Coating, Inc. Tell me what you do. We are an uh, asphalt maintenance company. We fix potholes, uh, cracks, Seal coating driveways, parking lots, restripe. So anything that has to do with asphalt, we can maintain it. And we've been uh, we're celebrating 25 years this year. Okay, and tell us your location or the number. Uh, we are on the east side of Joliet. Uh, we've been there since at least 15 years at that location. Our number is 815-774 Wolf 774-9653 or WolfSealCoating.com. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with uh, Bright Star, and you are? Jim Logan. I'm the owner. Jim, uh, what does uh, Bright Star do? Uh, we provide caregivers. We're a private home health care company. We can help families uh, taking care of their loved ones, whether they be children or seniors. And what we do is match uh, our plan of care to the family's needs and, of course, to their budget. That's uh, fantastic because I know I have health care uh, <laughs> issues with, uh, with my children. Um, what, what are some of the, do you have uh, individual programs? I mean, um, how, do you, how do you do that? Uh, what, we have a registered nurse, our director of nursing, who comes into the home and uh, does an assessment and then she develops a plan of care. So we don't have a specific program. Although we have a, a new promotion, what we call transitional care. Uh, if your loved one is coming out of a rehab facility or out of the hospital and coming home for first time in a while, we can help set up the house, do some shopping, housekeeping, and uh, do the linens and so forth. Well, that sounds great. Um, thank you very much for your time. Well, thank you for stopping. I'm here with Marcy at Mutual of Omaha uh, Life Insurance Company. Tell us a little bit about what you do. Sure, yes. We work with individuals, we work with um, small business owners, and we work with families globally to try to make sure that we um, take care of their needs throughout the stages of their life. Mutual of Omaha has been around for over 100 years. Most people even know, either know them for one of two reasons. They know them because 
a dad, a grandpa, a great grandpa has had something like an annuity or has had some kind of mutual mutual fund experience with us for the investor services side. But then there's also the um, insurance end of it. And that's what, you know, Lisa Belchick and myself are here today to try to make sure we help our community to be fully insured. Awesome. So where can the community of New Lenox find you? Sure. We are located at 192.55 um, Everett Lane and Suite C, and that's in Mokina, Illinois, 60448. Our phone number is 708-478-6625, and I'm at extension 270. Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking thank with you. us today. Have a great day. Nice to meet you. Hello. I'm actually here with Kitty and Pam from Remax. Kitty, tell me a little bit about the company. Oh, Remax has been here in New Lenox for how many years, Pam? Probably about 28 years. About 28 years. So we've, we're well established with uh, full-time agents that have been in the business a long time as we have. Uh, Pam Patterson is the manager. I am on the management team. Uh, we have many agents to help you with any of your needs, buying or selling a home. Okay, and Pam, do you want to tell us a little bit mm. more? We're located up above Gatto's Restaurant on the corner of Schoolhouse Road and Route 30. Open seven days a week. Stop in, see us. There's always someone there that will be able to help you with your needs. Excellent, thank you. Hi, can you tell me your name and a little bit about your services? My name is Ron Williams and we're with Will County Well and Pump, Complete Water System Specialist. We're a 75-year-old company here in New Lenox and we do primarily anything to do with water. We can drill your wells, put the wells in, fix your pumps, water softener, water treatment. If it's got to do with water, we can pretty well take care of it. Oh, great. That's fantastic. So how can people get a hold of your business? Yeah, we're, there's a website. You can go on willcounty.com. Uh, or you can 815-485-2413. Great, thank you very much. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, I'm here with uh, First Bank of New Lenox, and your name is? My name is Ryan, and I'm a, uh, a lender at the First Bank of New Lenox. Ryan, what are, we, what are we doing here? You guys got like lots of really cool swag here, and you got a nice... Uh... We got a lot going on because uh, even though we're a small community bank, we're just here to kind of promote everything that we do. Uh, we're more than just a deposit bank. We offer you know, kids' savings programs, mortgages, construction loans, um, normal savings accounts, equity loans, a little bit of everything. You know, we're a, like I said, we're a smaller bank, but we do everything a big bank does, yet we're still open seven days a week in, in the lobby, so we have you know, full access to our tellers. So it's a kind of a small community bank feel, but we offer everything, like I said, that a big bank is going to offer. So what are some of the advantages you feel that a small bank has over a large bank? Well, I think with a smaller bank, you come in, you're dealing always with the same people. Like as a loan officer, if you're doing a mortgage with me, you start with me from the application to closing. We don't pass you off to a processor or another mortgage department. You work with that lender. Um, if you're, you know, if you've been a customer for a long time, generally you work with the same loan officer for pretty much the whole, you know, your whole time with that bank. So we just try to keep everything very personal. Uh, like I said, we keep lobby uh, lobby hours seven days a week, so there's always a face for you to you know work with. You don't have to do everything online, or um, you're not at a kiosk. You're you're doing with real people all the time, and that's kind of what we try to portray uh, or, or or convey to our customers that you're always dealing with a person. All right, thanks very much for your time. Thank you, appreciate it. I am here with Maureen and Megan from Burkhot. So, what makes Burkhot stand out? Well, right now we're featuring our orange juice. We have our orange juice now in 15 of our stores, and that's been our main focus. We're doing a lot of demos with that. We make our own orange juice in our commissary in Orland Park, and we're also known for our meat. So if you talk to anybody in the neighborhood, they will say that we have a wonderful meat department and make our own fresh sausages and all kinds of great stuff like that. Awesome. So where can citizens find you? Well, we're in 15 locations. Uh, locally, you probably would find us around Mokina, right off of Wolf Road. We have New Lenox, we're off of Laraway and Cedar. Go a little bit farther north and you'll be in Orland Park. We're going to have a grand reopening in Orland Park very soon. And, and then you can go south, north, and you'll stumble upon us. <laughs> Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us thank today. You, Have yeah, a great one. Thank you very much. Cheryl. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I'm here with Cheryl and her and the company she's with. And she's going to introduce everyone and tell us what company she's here with. I'm Cheryl Hernandez, and I'm with Oplank Trail Community Bank, a Wind Trust Community Bank. 
and very happy to be here today with my coworkers. Um, this is Nancy Kuzma. She's our Vice President Market Manager in Frankfurt. And my good friend Anthony here heads up all our marketing uh, events um, so we can communicate in our communities. Does a great job. Okay, so tell us how long has the bank been located and has it been located in New Lenox? The bank was started in 2006. <clears throat> Excuse me, and we started with uh, three locations, two of which I believe I started in 2007. So 2006 is when the bank actually started. Um, I believe I was in a temporary location in Frankfurt while the other buildings were being built. So we've grown to 14, 15 locations under the Old Plank Trail Charter, but we have over 120 locations under the Wind Trust. Wind Trust is our parent company. Excellent, excellent. Anything else? Um, Nancy would like to. No. Yeah, we're um, we're a community bank, so we come out and we come out to all these events. We'll bring our snow cone machine. Um, we have great programs and savings accounts and things for the kids. We have uh, top business services. We're uh, a great business bank. And um, CD rates, uh, good savings account rates. So um, we think there's no beatable bank. So come on over to Old Plank Trail. Thank you. Hi, what's your name and Hi. can you tell me a little bit about the, your business and your booth here? Sure, uh, my name's Tim Kraft. I'm representing the American Legion here in New Lenox, uh, post 1977. And we're here at the uh, expo today to let the public know about us. Uh, we, we're open to the public. We have a beautiful canteen where people can come up and enjoy a beverage. Uh, we have Queen of Hearts drawing on Friday night. The pot's up to about $4,500 now. It just rolled last night. But our facilities are also open for banquets. So we have banquet rentals, we have a beautiful hall uh, for weddings, for um, different outings that you might have, like a, I don't know, child's uh, shower or something, birthday parties, all that. Uh, we also have uh, things that we do to support the vets in the area. We're, we've got a foot locker here for the Illinois Veterans Home in Mantino. We're looking for staple staples to help the vets, the elderly vets in that home, uh, clothing donations, toiletries, stuff like that. And we also um, have a memorial brick walkway that we are selling memorial bricks for. And we're having a golf outing in June. We're looking to sponsor, or for businesses to sponsor holes. June 24th at the Sanctuary, we're going to have our outing to benefit the Jeff Martin Memorial Scholarship Fund, where we give local ch uh, college kids sponsors or scholarships so there's a lot going on we want you to come up and visit us at the legion post and enjoy some enjoy yourself oh yeah great so where are you located at we're at 14414 west ford drive it's basically out on cedar south almost to laraway on the right hand side you can't miss us there's a big tank and big flagpoles all up the, over the front of it fantastic thank you thank you okay i'm here with granite mountain and your name is jennifer nelson Jennifer, what do we got here? What is, what's going on? We have um, granite and quartz countertops. These are just a few of the samples that we have. We do offer full slabs at our warehouse off of Illinois Highway by Bentley and Tyler School. So um, what, uh, what's the prettiest granite countertop that you have in your selection that you think? Um, I think Himalayan white is absolutely beautiful. That's a really great selection. Um, quartz, we also a bunch of great Cambria selections as well. All right. Um, do you have you ever um, do you have a granite countertop yourself? I actually do. We just put one in in our bar area. So, what are the advantages of the of the granite over any other type of surface? Granite has beautiful movement and change. You do need to seal it. It does come with a 15 year sealer, but you would need to reseal it every few years. Um, if you go with a quartz product, you don't ever have to worry about sealing it or stains. All right, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much. I'm here with Gary from Grounds Guys. Tell us a little bit about your company. Uh, Grounds Guys is a franchise that I own. We're nationwide. Uh, I've owned it now for four years. I've been doing lawn maintenance since 1991, and so the grounds guys offered me a uh, something that I was looking for, and so I jumped in about five years ago. 
Awesome. Do you have any special promos going on for the spring season? Uh, spring season for our fertilizing uh, programs. If you sign up for our five-year or our five-step program, we uh, include grub control for free. Awesome. Where can we find you? Uh, we're in New Lenox, where our shop is located on Ford Drive, 202 Ford Drive, which is by the American Legion. Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us today, and good luck. Thanks. Hello, and look who's here at the New Lenox Expo. Hi, my name is Dave Medema, running for New Lenox Township Road Commissioner. April 4th is the election. You will probably see this after that, but I wanted to say hello, and I hope that I got your vote on April 4th. Thank you. Hi, can you tell me your name and your business? My name is Mark Cummins. I'm from Treasured Images. Yes, and can you tell me a little bit about your business and the type of services you provide? Sure, we're a custom frame shop. Uh, we frame, our logo is you name it, we frame it. We'll frame anything from jerseys to anything, actually. Newspapers? I Newspapers. Could, papers? Yes. Where are you located at, Mark? We're located at 2061 Calistoga Drive, right next to Burkott's, right in that shopping center. Great. And do you have a website somebody can get a hold of you at? Uh, yes, it's treasuredimagesil.com. Great. Thanks, Mark. Thank you. I'm here with Dr. Jason with the Lincoln Way Chiropractic Clinic. Tell us a little bit about what you do here. Uh, what we do is we offer um, total, complete family care. So we, uh, we have a full x-ray suite on site, and we'll take care of any kind of pain relief, uh, wellness care. We do pediatrics all the way to um, the more uh, aged uh, population, so we can handle the whole family. And uh, we do very low force chiropractic treatments to help um, spinal health care. Awesome, and where can we find your location? Uh, we're at the southwest corner of Marley and 30, right there in New Lenox. Awesome, thank you for speaking with us today. Good luck. Hello, I'm here with Glenn from Costco's. Okay, tell us a little bit of what's new with Costco or things we didn't know. Well, Costco does a lot of services for its members and customers. And you have a travel agency within Costco that gives you the best value that you can find in a trip. They do all sorts of different services. They have a car buying service as well which I had did myself and I saved about $3,000 on a car purchase recently too. Wow. So there's a lot of things that value that Costco has in, in place for every member that joins and you can take advantage of that all the time, anytime. Okay, and what if you're single and you only, and you know, you usually can purchase in bulk. What are the advantages of not having a big family? Well, Costco has a lot of things like deli. They have uh, food already prepped that you could pick up as a single person or small family. Everything in Costco is not bulk either. That's another misnomer with a lot of people believe that uh, conception and don't realize they can shop there without buying a case of everything. And uh, things like they come packed in twos or threes even in some cases. So you still got to find things They have clothing, they have hardware, they have automotive stuff, tires for your car, uh, they have optical, you, you know, they have pharmacy, and all these things are available for Costco members to save you money. And they even have hearing aids for those that are older that are having issues hearing, that, which they start, their prices are start around 2000 which is pretty less, much less than others. Most of them start at like four to six, so we're really, uh, there's so much value in Costco that everyone that has a member can really get back their membership cost plus. Excellent. So. Excellent. Thank you. Hi, and can you tell us a little bit about the areas of, of locations you service and then how public can get a hold of you? Oh, yes. We're in some great areas. We are in New Lenox. We're in Mokina. We're in Palis, Palis Heights, Palis Park. We're in Frankfurt, Beecher, Elwood. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and give us a call and we have, there are home helpers locations throughout the Chicagoland area also. Licensed and insured, we do background checks to guarantee. Oh, and can you tell me your phone number and how people can get a hold of you? <laughs> oh yes, our phone number is 708-326-4001. Great, thanks Shannon. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.
Okay, so I'm here at uh, the booth for Margot McDermott, and your name is? I'm Kathy Hilton. I am the office manager for State Representative Margot McDermott's district office located at 11032 West Lincoln Highway in Frankfort Township. It's right across the street from Panera Broad. Margot is your state representative in the 37th Legislative District. And if you have any questions about state programs or legislation, please stop by and see us. I'm Leah and I'm here with Caitlin from Atrium Family Dental. Tell us a little bit about what you do. Uh, so we work with Dr. Sudman, he's our dentist, and we do all kinds of things. We do um, between the cosmetic stuff with the Invisalign to stuff that people need like the all in four and everything. So we do a bunch of stuff actually and just keeping people's mouth healthy. Do you have any special promos going on right now? Um, we do have, a, if you sign up, we have a free in-house bleaching right now for our raffle. And then we also offer like a membership program that we're kind of getting everybody to like aware of because awesome. that just released. Yeah, so where can we find you? Where's your location at? Uh, we are actually right across the street in the atrium by Gatto's and everything. We're right next to the bank towards that side. Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us today. Thanks. Good luck. Hello, I'm here with Maggie. And Maggie, you tell me what company you're here with. I'm here with Cash Creek Animal Rescue. We're located at 105, 1005 Star Lane in New Lenox. It's off of Illinois Highway in Cedar. We're an animal rescue. We've been in business, oh, 10 years. We have our adoption center here for about almost a year and a half. Uh, we love New Lenox. They've welcomed us with open arms. We have wonderful dogs and cats available for adoption. We have some dogs and cats, or dogs here. We've got two great Pyrenees down at the end, Brutus and Charlotte, who are gonna be two years old next month. They're siblings and most of our animals come from Southern Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, Missouri, where the poverty is so low and there's an abundance of animals. Our founder and director goes to so many different kill shelters to pick up animals to help them find their forever homes. We're having a puppy explosion. We've got four mamas in foster care right now who have puppies. We have Sweeney who has nine puppies, Elsa who I believe has seven. We've in the next couple of months, we're going to have puppies galore. We've got a couple puppies here. We've got six-week-old hound mixes, which we have more over at the shelter. We've got Bronco, who's a mixed breed, three months old, just adorable. Uh, we're always looking for people to volunteer. Our volunteer hours are 9 to 6. We love having children volunteer, waivers with their parents. We'd love to have everyone come and see us. We're, we do a lot of fundraisers. Check our website. We're also on the New Lenox Chamber of Commerce website. Uh, we're, our next major fundraiser is April 22nd, Sipping for the Shelter, Wine Tasting with Huma uh, Wines for Humanity. They are an awesome group, and the proceeds go to the shelter. We only have 70 tickets left, so they're so $45 a piece. Complimentary wine glass comes with it. It's going to be awesome and a lot of fun. Excellent. Okay, I'm here with the Animal Clinic at New Lenox, and your name is? My name is Tina. Tina, what are we doing here? Um, uh, we are actually, um, I'm the hospital manager at the clinic, and um, we, this is our, um, probably about our sixth or seventh year participating in the expo. Um, we have been in the New Lenox community um, since, uh, actually Dr. Shields started the practice back in the 1970s, and then in 2000, Vetcor came in and they assumed um, ownership of the practice, um, and we've still been practicing in the New Lenox community. Um, we are part of the New Lenox Chamber, and we like to give back to the community as much as possible. Um, we've done some pro bono work with Sheriff Fest New Lenox um, as well as um, with the Chamber and um, actually uh, we were voted 2015 Business of the Year uh, for the New Lenox Chamber of Commerce so um, we just love pets and um, we have a real um, small um, family of, of clients and doctors and um, we just treat every pet that walks through the door as if it were one of our own so. That's great. Uh, what's the most unusual pet that you've seen come into the um, we see primarily dogs and cats at our practice, um, but we've had um, some really big dogs. Um, we've had Great Danes and Mastiffs, and um, one of our new technicians actually has a Great Dane puppy. We just did um, some tours for the 4-H uh, um, club, and uh, we had the kids come in and listen to the dog's heartbeat, and everyone was just amazed at how big, uh, you know, um, 
the great or the St. Bernard was. I'm sorry, she has the St. Bernard. The St. Bernard was, and that it just laid there and let everybody listen to their heartbeat and stuff like that. But a lot of my team actually works with local rescue, and um, we have a little um, puppy here today that belongs to one of our technicians, and she actually um, did, adopted from a rescue. His name is Luke. So, so awesome. Well, thank you very much for your time. I'm here with Laura and the Flirty on 30 Boutique, which I drive by all the time. It's a super cute store. Please tell us what you can find inside. Thank you. Flirty on 30 is a boutique that caters to all women. We carry contemporary clothes along with accessories. Awesome. So where exactly on Route 30 can we find you? We are west of Cedar on the south side close to El Burrito Loco. Awesome. Well, thank you for speaking with us today, and I hope to stop pleasure. in and see you. Absolutely. We would love for you to come in. Thank you. Hello. I'm here with Sandy, and Sandy is bubbly. And tell us, <laughs> tell us what company you're here with. I am here with Cairo One Medulla. Um, we are the leading chiropractic practice in the state of Illinois, so we're very proud of that. We've been around since 1981. Um, we are here doing complimentary posture and spine checks for vendors and for the community um, just to reassure the importance of your spine and why it's so important to get your spine checked. So your spine controls everything in your body. We want to make sure we have a healthy spine because healthy spine means we're going to function better and feel better. This is not medicine. This is not surgery. It's just getting your body to function better than you're functioning right now. And that's what we're here sharing with our community. How to get Americans a little healthier for 2017 without the medicines or surgery. Excellent. And did you tell us where you're located? Okay, I didn't. We have 41 clinics. Um, this is the map of all 41 clinics. We have suburban clinics and we have city clinics. And my closest clinic is actually across the street, right above Gatto's. That's our new Lennox clinic, and that's Dr. Shehab. He's phenomenal. So, yes, come visit us at any one of our 41 clinics. I thank you. Okay, I'm here at the uh, New Lennox Community Business uh, Expo. And uh, what's your name? My name is Rich Olowski. Rich, uh, what are you doing here? Well, I'm a Channel 6 volunteer here, so what I'm doing here is I'm helping tape all these great boots out here um, on behalf of Channel 6. Um, is that uh, something that anybody can do? Anybody in the village of New Lenox or around our town can volunteer and be a Channel 6 uh, volunteer. That's fantastic. Um, what, what goes into actually filming this? Well, what we do is we just uh, grab a camera, uh, an interviewer, and we go up to each booth, ask them a few questions, and then we do a nice little short little spot so they could promote their business. And on the upside is that doing this is great. I have a lot of fun doing this. Um, this year I'm running a camera, which I haven't done in a while, and uh, I got a great interviewer working with me who's also a new volunteer. And it's really fun being a volunteer here at Channel 6. All right. I think so, too. So thanks, thanks for the interview and thanks for your time. Thank you. And remember, New Lenox, Channel 6.